how much time do I put on one as opposed to the other because you're not supposed to leave it on just one. What do you tell them? Well, at the beginning of the colostrum phase, it doesn't really matter because colostrum is just colostrum, but once your milk comes in, there's two forms. There's fore milk and hind milk, and once you're in 15 minutes into a nursing session is the hind milk, which has all the fat. So you want to keep it one breast per feeding just so that your baby gets to the fat and then stays full in between feeds because if you're switching off the baby, because that, that was what was be back in the day before, you know, evidence-based and, you know, research, people were switching them off. So your baby was basically getting fat-free milk and that's why they were probably still hungry because then they ended up supplementing and giving, you know, other things other than just breast milk. So your suggestion is when you start is how? Yeah, you can, I mean, there's no time frame either. You tell however long the baby wants to nurse for, as often as he wants, like I said, but as long as he's satisfied. So when the video is showed that about the relaxed arm and then the wet diapers and the weight gain, and if you're meeting all that, then you're, you don't need to keep you know, switching off. And is it true that some people say that um, formula is a little bit more substance and heavier so the baby sleeps longer as opposed to the breast milk? That is true. Not that it's better, but that's what I hear. Right. I mean, breast milk is easily digestible, so that's why they're hungrier more often. And then formula just kind of sits there and it's harder for them to digest. And when a mom says, you know, I just don't want to, and mm -hmm. what, you know, and which is fine. Right. I think it's a personal choice. Right. What do you say? I mean, it's all or no it's not all or nothing. So even if you did it for a month or two months, you know, at least you provided that little bit of, you know, and coverage for infections and anything helps at all. So it's like I said, it's all, you have to put in your 100%. If you're not into it 100%, then you're not going to succeed at it. But they shouldn't feel bad as long as you know they tried, or if they don't want to, they shouldn't feel guilty. It's a personal decision.